Just look at these dogs. You can see they are getting washed. They're getting a flea bath. They are doing much better after going through an ordeal more than 50 miles away. The dogs didn't bark, didn't cry out as volunteers carried the canines to safety in Northwest Houston. There are Chihuahuas, Pomeranians, Chihuahua Pomeranians. Uh, we have two bloodhounds and then some setter mixes. It almost seemed these furry friends instinctively knew they're about to embark on their best lives. We got there just about two o'clock and we started loading up all the dogs. How many dogs did you end up with? We ended up with 59 dogs. Passionate people with Lola's lucky day rescued the dogs from a breeding situation gone bad in Shepherd, Texas. And it just kind of got out of control. Um, they didn't have the money to do spay and neuter, and this is unfortunately what happens. They say the good thing here, the folks in trouble reached out for help. They did. They knew that they needed help. They reached out for help. Um, so, you know, they, 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 we're interested in doing better for their animals. The volunteers will now work to find a permanent place for the dogs. They'll go to other rescue groups and might even head north to Wisconsin. Number one, we need fosters. There are a lot more dogs that need homes that, you know, there's just not anywhere to put them. Um, second would be donations because all of these dogs have to be vetted before we adopt them out. If you want to help the group helping these dogs, we've posted more information inside ABC13.com. Better yet, man's best friends are always in need of foster homes. Here in Houston, um, being such a big city, we have such a huge epidemic of unwanted animals. So it's really rewarding to me to be able to help these dogs that are unwanted find great loving homes. In